Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we are talking about GM3 uh, versus Reiner D. Ryder, Riddler. Right. No, that's not correct. Reiner D. Ritter. I think that's how you say it. Uh, GM3, 37 wins, 17 losses. He's 3-2 and two in his last five fights. Plus 215 underdog, 6-1 with a 77 and a half inch reach. Fighting Reiner, who's 17 and 2, also 3 and 2 in his last five fights. His loss, his last two losses were that and and Anatoly Malikin, Malikin, that guy's a monster. Minus 280 favorite, 34 years old, 6'4", the 79.1 inch reach, couple inch reach advantage for a Rid Ritter, Ritter, it's Ritter, three inches in height as well. It's the same issue I have when I talked about it in my short. GM3 gets hit. Big, big strikers, technical strikers like Pfeiffer and like some of these other guys are able to get to him. He gets hit. He got hit in his last fight, even though he looked pretty good. He got the Edmund Shabazian one. He got hurt early. I, 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 GM3, of course, can win it because of his grappling, but he's going to have to weather the storm. Can he survive another storm? You know, and also, it was two months ago. He was just hurt to the body, so... I have such a hard time picking GM3 in this one because I'm so worried about him getting caught by Reiner because Reiner is a really, really good striker. Now, can GM3 get a takedown quickly? I don't know. We'll find out. I'm going with the veteran. I don't feel very confident about it. It's a low confidence pick. I like GM3 a lot, but I'm really worried because he's very susceptible to being hit and he does get hurt in his matchups. That is the reality. I mean, if you look at it, let's see. Uh, da, 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 da. Bring it back a little bit. View matchup. Let's do GM3. All righty then. Here we go. So, let's look. Knockdown. Petrovsky had a knockdown. Let's see. Chemayev had a knockdown. That was finished. Ian Heinous had a knockdown. Oscar, whatever that name is, had a knockdown. Yeah. All right. So maybe not as much as I thought, but still. Shabazi was out striking him. You know, let's see. Jotko was out striking him. I was talking pretty bad in that one. Muradol was out striking him, and then he came back and won. Ian Heinish was out striking him, and then finished him. He, Duran Wynn was definitely not out striking him. That boy. E. 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 Jack Manson outstruck him. I mean, terribly outstruck him. Uh, Tiago Santos outstruck him. So again, there's 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 hesitations there for me because of what I see. But right in with GM3, let's go submission. If he's going to win, it's probably going to be by submission. But as always, guys, subscribe, like, comment. Let me know what you're picking. Peace.